Hi, welcome back to Cat's Kentucky Corner. I wanted to jump on and do this video because I have a few things that I still haven't put out for Christmas when most of my house is decorated. And I'm like, oh yeah, I forgot about that. So if you watched the Target haul, you probably heard me talk about a little bit from Hobby Lobby and Walmart. I wanted to show you guys some of it. I've already had to pull off the walls from uh, the bathroom. If you looked at my little video short of the Grinch, I had some of those decorations up. Um, let me show you those. I think, yes, this came from Hobby Lobby. Um, they had this whole aisle of um, Snoopy, Grinch, and the movie Elf, which I love. Hello. Um, 20 years, I think, is the um, anniversary for Elf, which kind of blows my mind. Where did that time go? Um, anyways, we picked these out. We thought they were really cute. Instead of putting them on my tree, I just thought it'd look cute. I used those little on-demand hooks, and they're hanging over my sink. So, we have... Max, and we have the Grinch, and little Cindy Lou Who. And then, um, you'll probably see a video later on this, but my husband and I like to get um, nutcrackers each year. So, um, when I saw this guy, I was like, oh my gosh. We need him. I thought he was really cute. I've actually seen one at Walmart too where he's holding a can of Hoo Hash. That's pretty cute too, but um, this one's just him holding the Who's presents. Then uh, we picked up this, which is sitting in my bathroom. Not right now, obviously, because I'm showing you, but I have it sitting by my little Grinch tree. He's really neat. Let me dig in here and set Walmart down in the floor for a minute. Uh, great stuff. Oh, I'd forgotten about her, so this is what I meant by there's things I totally forgot about that I gotta find a place for now. <laughs> little Cindy Lou Who, she's a little bobblehead. I thought was really cute. You always see Grinch and Max stuff, but sometimes um, Cindy Lou you don't always see, but this year you've been seeing some stuff of hers, especially at good old Hobby Lobby. <laughs> um, speaking of her, I forgot about having this. We got this little doll of her. Now, I do have a stuffed animal of the Grinch that my cousin Tammy bought my grandmother many years ago. Um, it was from the Coles Care line that they do, the $5 stuffed animals. And after my grandma passed, I really told her, I said, I'll buy it from you. I really want that because I love the Grinch. And she ended up giving it to me, so thank you, Tammy, if you're watching. Um, so we have it sitting in the recliner, and I just realized um, we have a Max stuff animal that I forgot to bring over here. So hopefully, let me, let me grab it real quick. I hate leaving the screen. I feel weird doing that, but hold on one second. And then you get Max. I'm coming back, I promise. Ah! We saw him, and we're like, he needs to come home with us. So he can sit by the Grinch in our recliner in our family room in here. So there's that. And then we'll have to sit Cindy Lou over there now too because I forgot about her. So I'll let them sit here for a second. What else? Um, speaking of Grinch, got a couple new dish towels for the kitchen. This one says, maybe Christmas perhaps means a little bit more. So sweet, love it. And then this one just says, definitely naughty. I mean, now I have a more Grinch thing. And if you watched my Christmas tear tray, and I said I was probably gonna tweak it and work on it some more, I'm gonna have to now because I had planned to put this little statue on there somewhere. Let me zoom in, it's Max and Grinch and says, naughty and nice really cute and i think i've maxed you out haha <laughs> no pun intended on uh, oh i said that well you'll see in a minute i'm not gonna do walmart just yet as far as hobby lobby goes i've maxed out on um those items let's switch gears to um back to nutcrackers real quick so I saw one day when I was without my husband in Hobby Lobby, I said, oh, they've got Charlie Brown Nutcracker. 
Uh, so they've got Snoopy too, but you want to just do Charlie Brown. He goes, well, no, you can't just buy Charlie Brown and not buy Snoopy. Well, I wasn't going to argue with him there. So Snoopy came home too. I think they're really cute. I actually have a couple of Halloween Charlie Brown and Snoopy Nutcrackers that I put out at Halloween time. I'm pretty sure I showed that in the video during Halloween. But I thought these were really cute and I have them sitting on our new shelf over here. Actually, I have it sitting on top of a book that I have that's about the making of Charlie Brown Christmas. I absolutely love those, but you'll hear me say that about a lot of Christmas movies because there's not too many that I don't love. <laughs> I can't help it. Um, let me show these because these are just some ornaments. Did we need them? No. But you know how I feel about the bumble. If you see me open up my lounge fly bag. So I said, well, he's cute. So we got that ornament. And then we just decided to pick the rest of them up too. Santa Claus. And little Rudolph as well. The real felt stuff felt. But real cute where the Grinch ones were like metal, tin metal kind of material. Let's see. Um... Okay, this, I yes, I want to get to using this. So I was like, i got to get this video filmed after work today. It is a little plush throw from the movie Elf. I could not resist. Did I need another blanket? No, I did not. But it's Elf, and it's one of my all-time favorite movies. So this came home as well. And that same day, my husband and I went... Hobby Lobby probably really liked us that day. <laughs> we got these little signs. It says there's room for everyone on the nice list. And then this is how I feel. I love it. Treat every day like Christmas. I love it. Love it. Love it. Um, and the last thing I think from Hobby Lobby and it's elf related is this little snow globe. Those Light's going to glare on it. Um, well, I don't know how to keep it from glaring, guys. But. It's an overhead light. There's nothing to do about it. Like. But it says Santa's coming, and we all know. But he gets very excited when um, he finds out Santa's coming. So uh, at some point I'll show my shelf over here, but it's decorated. Um, right now I've got nutcrackers on different shelves. And then on my bottom shelf uh, I have elf things along with some of those cute little felt duos you saw me show from Target. Um, last, I want to show you from Walmart. Now, again, I bought these for my tiered tray and forgot about it. I don't know if I'll have room for them or not. I'm going to have to mess around with that here in a minute. But these are clearly, I think, made for, like, tiered trays. The plastic is glaring. It's driving me crazy. There we go. It's Max, Cindy Lou, and Grinch. And they're just little wooden figurines. And as I said, they make a lot of these kind of little sets for particularly to make fillers for tiered trays. And then they had, and I've seen people do trees like this, and I think it's so cute, and I someday would love to have, I don't know where I put it, but a Grinch tree, because they've made like the topper, like his head, and you can get his butt to stick out from the side of the tree. And then you have his hand coming out from the tree holding that ornament. But I did grab this, because I think it's just really adorable. I love it. And that covers everything, but I will show this cute sweatshirt I found. Now, obviously, I live in Kentucky, as I've said. And spoiler alert for my family members, on Christmas Eve, we go to my husband's family. This might be my husband's shirt, yeah. Um, I got us these sweatshirts. We usually match on Christmas Eve. And, gosh, I got these back in October, so they probably, they may not even have these anymore. But it says... Santa Claus is coming to Kentucky. 
So we know he's coming to Kentucky. I don't know if he's coming to the rest of your states. I'm just kidding. If you've been good and you're on the nice list, same as Kevin. <laughs> but I thought these were adorable. So I picked myself one and one from a hub on Christmas for Christmas Eve. And I'll probably wear it before Christmas Eve as well. Shoo! All right. I think we made it through, guys. Um, if you like this video and you like these kinds of videos, give me a thumbs up. Comment below what your favorite item was. Um, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell for when I do upload videos. And if you made it through the end of this, yay, thank you. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed. Maybe it gives you some ideas to decorate with. But until we meet again, happy tales to you. Bye.